and welcome back to Rob's Homemade. I just need to grab this. Um, today, sorry for the little bit of confusion here, we are here for an unboxing video. Well, actually, we have one, two, three, four. We have the postman's been a, been a very, very busy boy at my house for the last two or three days. Every day this week I've been at work and my missus texts me the parcel for his, I've missed the parcel, you need to go and collect it, you need to go and do this, and I'm like, oh my. I actually forgot how much I ordered um, over the last weekend. But I'm so looking forward to opening these. I know what most, what's in most of these boxes. I'm gonna start I'm going to start, I'm going to put them all, all, all over the place, yeah. I'm going to start with this one. This didn't turn up like this. I was, this come today, and I was like, I haven't ordered nothing else. I've had my three parcels, what is this? And I, the conversation I had with a chap on Facebook, he's an Asian chap who lives in London, I can't remember his name. It's Nikki Satel, maybe. Sorry if I've pronounced your name wrong. He's just starting off a hot sauce company of his own and fair play to him, big up to him. He got in contact with me, he's seen my videos before and asked me if I would review a couple of his sauces, a couple of his uh, original sauces. And I'm like, yeah, dude, send them down to me. I'll quite happily let you know what I think. And they came today, but I forgot. So I ripped it open, which is why it's in the messy team. So here is the first one. We have Sauce Boy Hot Sauce. I'm going to run through these properly when I do the review. So, uh, a delightful fruity sauce with a perfect blend of spi uh, sweet, spicy, natural sweetness of fresh ingredients. Shake off fruit. Ingredients are all in there. And it's called the Sauce uh, Saucy Boy Hot Sauce. His website is there, but it's not actually up and running yet. So he sent me two. He sent me both of these. And I just want to say thank you very much. And they will go down the tree, I'm sure. And we'll review those very, very soon. Um, established in London in 2020. Like I said, he's only just started out. And I'm going to hopefully give him a big thumbs up. When we review these sources of his, he's a like I said, he's an Asian chap, really nice to talk to. Got on with him well, um, through Facebook Messenger, and he sent me these. His labels, his labels are nice. I do like those labels. So that's the first of the uh, unboxing. In fact, I'm going to put these up here, so we can sh keep them on show. So. Saucy Boy, Hot Sauce Company, hopefully a big up and coming one, and hopefully I'll be one of the first to get my hands on them. So we're gonna go, I'm gonna leave this one to last. I'm gonna leave this one to last. A couple of people know what's in here, a couple of people who watch the channel, I've already shown this to them, and I was excited. So we're gonna go with, the, this is massive, it's huge. So, everybody knows who watches my channel, knows I do a lot of shopping at tasteofthestates.com. A lot of shopping there, because I like to get different types of stuff. Well, I found a new website it's called jessicasweets.co.uk. It's very, very similar to tasteofthestates.com, but they have some different type of stuff on there. So between Taste of the States and Jessica Sweets, my bank balance is going to be zero. So this box here is what I spent at Jessica Sweets. So 
it's a lot of stuff. It is a lot of stuff. But me and John are going to have a field day with this lot. So, the first things first. We have TJ Fridays. We all know it was an American place, which is now over here in the UK. We have Crunchy Fries, Extreme Heat. TJ Fridays, Extreme Heat, Crunchy Fries, set your taste buds ablaze with the sweet burn you crave. In here, it's always Friday. So there's one for us, John. And I came across, I've got to juggle these about a little bit because I want to do certain things. Right. The next one, we've done a lot of hers products, but this one caught my eye. Hers Creamy Ranch and Habanero. John, these are big bags, dude. Are we going to finish him? I'm sure we will. So that's another one. We also have a couple of little... This. I saw this and I just had to buy it. I had to buy it. You'll see why. I've never actually mentioned this program before. I don't think I've ever mentioned this program before in videos. But I love it. It's this. I love The Simpsons. This is, I can still watch The Simpsons as a 44 year old man and laugh and crease. This is Duff Energy Drink. A can of Duff is just something I never ever thought I would ever have in my hand as a youngster growing up watching The Simpsons when it very first started to still enjoying it now i now officially have a can of duff in my hand awesome 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 so that's another thing that me and johnny boy are going to enjoy we have got an off sauce as well from jessica sweets we have something i've never seen before i'm going to throw these on the floor Audrey D, Rebel Hot Sauce, Mental Hot Sauce, Jehokli Ghost Pepper. They've got, I'm going to go through this properly when, obviously, when we do the review. But there we go. Audrey D, Aubrey D, Jehokli Ghost Pepper Hot Sauce. I might have a quick look, actually. Sneaky bit. Actually, no, I'm not going to have a sneaky peek. We're going to put that there. Right. There's two more things in Jessica's sweets box. <coughs> we have these. I saw these and I'm just like, you know what? Uh, these in class. We have. We can't change the world unless we change ourselves. These are wrap snacks, icon bag. Notorious B.I.G. Cookout Barbecue Sauce Crisps. I know I've been doing a lot of snack reviews lately, but when I saw these wrap snacks, I was like, yo, some of these flavours, barbecue sauce flavour, got to be done. So that's one of them. We also have another wrap snack. This one's a wavy one. Little Boosies, Louisiana Heat, and I'll be perfectly honest, living in the UK, I have no idea who Little Boosies is. If you want to leave a comment below and let me know this type of video, or maybe leave a link to a YouTube video of his music, I will check it out. So, yeah, we've got a collection going on over here, but that's everything. From Jessica Sweets, and I guarantee 100% I will be ordering from them again, as well as Taste of the State, as well as everywhere else I shop. So we've got a nice, um, these are the ones I'm looking forward to the most Creamy Ranch and Habanero. I really am looking forward to those. And the TGI Fridays Extreme Heat. 
Saucy boys, hot sauces, more so there. So, on to box number three. Like I said, my postman it has been a very busy boy lately. And this one, I know what it is. And I am very, very, very excited for what's in here. Do, do, do. I love tuna. I'm like, this is just like my Christmas day. My Christmas day is here now, on opening boxes. We received the following order from Mr. Robert Jakes. The League of Fire. Ha ha. What did I buy though? I bought. We'll put some floor. From the creators of the Death Note Challenge, which I still have to do, of course, Carolina Reaper Corn Nugs. Yeah, boy. I have a feeling me and Johnny Boy will be talking some hot and spicy corn nugs very soon. I'm gonna go. There's two more things in here. Two more, two more. We'll go with this one. I'm gonna crack this one open. This is the League of Fire. One year hot sauce anniversary. League of Fire chili eating champion. Anus Primus. Made by Henry's Hot Sauces. I'm, I'm going to read this properly when it comes to it. This is a barbecue sauce. It looks delicious. It's only got a three chili heat rating, which you know it's going to be nice. It's not going to be chug challenge heat. So I'm looking forward to that. That looks so nice. It looks really, really barbecue-y. It looks like it'd go well on ribs, on a burger, that sort of thing. So yeah, the League of Fire Angus Primus barbecue hot sauce. Boom! I that to, this, this is gonna take over the set easy. This one is a little bit special and it's a little bit um how can I say it? It's special to me. Because this sauce is made by a company and a guy in particular who in sort of inspired me to start this channel in a way. Well, start the hot sauce challenge version, um, the hot sauce review side of this channel. Because I used to, I, I still watch him to this day. I'm struggling to get this open now because he's been wrapped really well. And when I saw he brought out a hot sauce, I was like, how the hell am I going to get my hands on one of them? Because he, he was made for the States. Then all of a sudden, League of Fire said, we're selling this sauce on our website. I went over, straight away, bang, sold out. I was like, oh, gutted, absolutely gutted. And then Luciano put up a post on Facebook saying, um, the sauce was back on sale. Mate, I was on it like that. And I managed to get myself, Chase the Heat, Pineango Hot Sauce, Made in collaboration between Blazing Foods and Johnny Scoville, the man himself. Uh, the man a lot of people look up to in the hot sauce community because he was the first kind of guy who was doing hot sauce reviews on YouTube, doing all this and sort of maybe inspired, like I said, inspired me a little bit to go towards that and do hot sauce reviews and chase, and chase the heat. So to speak, it's a Carolina Reaper pineapple and mango hot sauce. 
I love the label, the label's so cool. So, I am so looking forward to trying this one. I've seen him review so many sources. I've reviewed a lot of sources in my time now. Um, but yeah, looking good. And I know for a fact he re-released this in a bigger bottle because this is, this is like a four ounce bottle. It's only got a heat level of three, which I'm glad of because I want it to be nice. I want it to be tasty. And by the looks of it, it's already going on a pizza or a taco. So that's that. So that's the last of the League of Fire. So. I'm down to one. One last box of stuff. Anybody who's ordered these will know what's in this by the size and shape of the package. So we have Rummy Bears. These are Carolina Reaper Gummy Bears. I was told they were available in the UK. I went to the website rummybear.com. They didn't ship to the UK. And once again, any UK, Luciano, thank you so much for pointing me in the right direction. These are available from Dr. Bueno's Hot Sauce Emporium. If you want to go and get yourself some Carolina Reapy Bull Rummy Bears. I, this is a challenge. Um, I'm going to read a little bit of the back of this before I give and before I have to put all this away. Um, we do not advise anyone to consume more than one bear at a time. The challenge is six bears in four minutes, then another six bears in another four minutes. So they, these are not advising anybody to eat more than one. Doing so could cause severe pain, stomach cramps, fever, sweating, hysteria, vomiting, nausea, loss of appetite for up to 24 hours. If that's not enough to put you off this packet, I don't know what is. But you know me, I will get round to doing this challenge sooner or, sooner or later, probably later because I'm terrible for keeping. The problem I've got I'll give you my main problem with challenges. I cannot do Monday to Friday because I've got to get up and go to work because that's how I earn my money. <clears throat> so I have like one day where I could possibly do a challenge on like a Friday or a Saturday and then it ruins the next day because I'm in agony all night or all day and if we want to do something that day I call do it. So I'm very restricted time wise to do challenges where a lot of people can do them during the day because they don't have to go to work or they're still furloughed or whatever reason they've got to be able to do challenges I struggle to find the time to do them but anyway that was my unboxing of a massive amount of stuff I'm going to quickly look how much stuff I've bought in the last week is just, just <laughs> I'm surrounded by sauces, surrounded by crisps, I'm Duff Energy Drink. These videos are going to be amazing. Me and John are going to absolutely, I'm going to move on and down the line. Me and John are going to smash these videos. We've got some really good stuff coming. Got the chug challenge, we've got the corn nubs, we've got the crisp reviews, we've got the duck beer, we've got the reapers, we've got so much coming, I don't know where to start half the time. I've still got stuff in my cupboard to review, still got food reviews to do, but some amazing stuff that I've ordered and I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you enjoyed the boxing. 
leave a comment below about what you want to see done first and I will try and arrange to get your favourites or what you want to see done first because I'm all about listening to you guys, listening to, reading your comments, hearing what you want me to do and trying my best to get the content, content out there for you. So you've seen everything, you've seen the Chris, you've seen the sources, you've seen the corn nugs, you've seen the challenges. Let me know what you want to see me, to, you want to see me do first and I would 100% try my best to get them done first. So I just want to say thank you very much for watching. Smash that like button, hit that subscribe button and I will be back very, very soon. Peace!